What's up, y'all? I'm gonna show y'all how to uh, change the brake light on a 2017 uh, Ford Focus ST. I'm making this video just because, honestly, it took me forever to find a good video, and I just feel like people weren't really being clear with it. Um, you need one of these, and then a new bulb, of course, and that's pretty much all you need. Uh, pretty much right here in the trunk, uh, there's this little compartment here you can take that off and then you're gonna see that uh plastic screw there you got one and then up top you got two um you can try using your your fingers here but it's gonna be a little bit tough um, so that's why i recommend grabbing one of these just unscrew it once you uh, loosen it up you can actually use your fingers here. Um, just be real careful, just because if you drop it in there, uh, you're done. So just make sure uh, you're very careful. Um, just put it to the side here so you don't lose it. And then do the same thing for the top one here. and just like i said make sure you save those just because if it falls in there yeah all should break and loose there so now uh this thing should be pretty loose um i'm filming with one hand but i'm gonna try to uh, pop it open here so you'll see it's kind of loose right so just try to pop it out obviously be a little gentle but get some power into it of course Go, and then it should pop loose you should see some wires in there um, depending on which bulb you're switching you've got a uh, different ones so you've got one here second one here and then the third one this is the one i'm switching today um, for all of these they've got little handles all you gotta do is just turn it and bam there we go and it's real simple all you're gonna do pull this guy out I can't show you here, but you'll pull it out, uh, get your new one, put it in there, and then you'll pop it back in place here. So you'll, this is a tricky one. You have to make sure it matches up here. Just look at the grooves on it. So the wide one is here. Just make sure it matches up with it. There we go and then pop it back. And you'll hear like a little snap there. And uh, there you go. And then, yeah, just pop it back in place. Uh, when you pop it back in place, you'll see these uh, screws here. I right, got one here and the other there. Make sure you match it up well when you're uh, putting it in the holes here. There should be a quick snap there. And there we go. Lastly, put these guys back on there just like the way that they were. So tighten it as best as possible. Um, and then the top one as well. Yeah, and if you got really big hands, like, this is actually kind of tough for me. But if you have smaller hands, it's much easier. And then just place this back on. And uh, there we go. Let me know what y'all think.